YouTube, what it do, man? Low Muscle Up Wildlife, man. Today, watching the big dogs today, man. Part two of that deep cleaning, man. So we got our tub here. It's kind of a little dirty, but you know what it is here. And we got our soap here. I know everybody like to use the Dawn with the flea and tick and shit, man. But, you know, we try to stay as natural as possible. Anything with coconut in it, shea butter, uh, olive oil, um... Did I say coconut? <laughs> coconut. We, we love coconut. But yeah, we try to stay as natural as we can. So these are certain problems we use. Um, we had a braid techco. Uh, it's in there too as well. We give them to them after we bathe them and whatnot. So they, they eat that as well. Or we put some little solution on the back of them. And they, however it go. But yeah, that's how we do. Stop using that Dawn. And that shit dry your damn dog skin out. You got to keep the dog skin moisturized with the, uh, olive oil or, or coconut oil. So... We definitely like to use, you feel me, natural stuff, you know what I'm saying? So, you gotta use that Clorox too, now I'm just playing, but <laughs> yeah, man, let's get to the video, man. <laughs> Alright, so man, got the tub filled. Got my first three victims right here. Boom, 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 you see the tub. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wash them all first. Then I dump them in the tub. Big shout out to uh, Raul, man, the QB and Kim. He put me on game with the apple cider vinegar and peroxide, you know what I'm saying, with the deep bathing, so definitely gotta show love on that, but we're gonna put them in there after we finish. So let's get into it and wash them up. After that, we're gonna throw them in here, let them soak for a little bit, get them on in. Yeah, man, like I said, we gotta use these birds, man. Lather them up real good, wash them up. Then we'll throw some uh, some flea and tick shampoo, uh, moisturizing conditioner on. Soapy clean, man. Make sure, make sure y'all clean the ears as well. Face. You know, after you finish, we get a rag. Face. Wipe, um, wipe their face down. Clean their ears. You know, make sure you keep the nails cut. Got to keep the nails cut. Now you want to come to the water. Now you want to come. You see how she doing? You see how she just sitting there chilling? Why well, I can't get you to do that, Ben? Huh? Ben. Why well, I can't get you to do that, man? Thank you, bro. Let me just, yeah, there we go. Thank you. See, I'm pretty good boy, Bentley. Good boy. Come on, Latte. Good girl. I know, I know. Good girl. I'll try to bend it because I tried to, I tried to have that moment with you, bro. You didn't want to have it with me, bro. Good girl, I say. Mm, good girl, baby. Mm. Alright, got the first one going in. I'm gonna put all three of them in at the same time. Alright, come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Got Kool-Aid picture, man. We don't really drink Kool-Aid like that, so <laughs> just know we don't drink any of it. But there go one, one kind. Of Come on, girl, you got to get back in here. So funny. Lee, try to help. Thank you, bro. <laughs> thank you, Lee. I appreciate you, bro. I right, thank you. Give me five. Yeah, we don't need it right now. We don't need it, man. Let them sit for about two more minutes, man. Try them off. Get them in. And well, I got what? Three down there. Same thing with three more. So, you know, dump the water out. Rinse. Wash. I think I said rinse, wash, repeat. I think that's right. 
wash, rinse, repeat. That's what it is. Wash, rinse, repeat. <laughs> so yeah, man. We're gonna do the same thing with the next three, man. Just real quick, you know what I'm saying? Just to keep. You know what I'm saying? And especially getting all that dead hair, dead skin, all, all the follicles and everything off of them, man. You know, just all the grime and dirt they may, you know, be out here playing in the dirt and mud and stuff like that. So, you definitely want to just, you know what I'm saying, soak them, actually get it deep clean so, you know what I'm saying, they skin can shine at its best, man. But that's just a little how we do it, man. Like I said, we're going to get the other ones, let y'all see that, and then we out of here, man. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Like, comment, something that, you know, feel me, I may not know what soap you may use, you know what I'm saying, or how you may bathe them. Just comment, let me know something, man. I appreciate y'all, man. Yeah, so, got my baby heifer. Bought some old soap out, too. I like this one too. This is nice, good. Got that Lord Vera in it. Shit, good as hell. Put the skin into it, well. So yeah, next we the Flea and Tick shampoo. Got the rosemary and peppermint oil. I do use this to get them all clean with the Flea and Tick. Let that sit for like five, ten minutes, man. We're gonna wash them off, rinse them off. My bad, I'm sorry. She just gotta be different. I understand. Uh-uh, uh-uh, no, 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 heifer. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Hopefully they sit in there for like five, ten minutes, which I know these two really not <laughs> capable of because they are on go as always. But we like to let them sit in there for five, ten minutes and um, you have to get them out, dry them down. You have to dry down by like 30 minutes to an hour. <laughs> and then after that, we'll come in coconut oil or olive oil, whichever one, you know, just to make sure that on the skin don't dry out. But yeah, that's why I say we like to use everything natural and everything. There's nothing that won't harm their skin. You know, especially with blues, they have sensitive skin. Anything to a touch, they'll break out from the food to chemicals, anything. So either from uh, grass, like, like I said, they, they had a, most, some of the worst allergies uh, out of the dogs. But with the blues, so yeah, man, we just like to be mindful of that. Take take heed to that. And yeah, man, so <laughs> that's about it, man. Um, we ain't gonna hold y'all too long, you know. <laughs> got my hands kind of full, but yeah, I got another dog down there too. But yeah, that boy, he all dirty right now. He decided to go play in some mud. So yeah, we'll, we'll say that for another day, man. But other than that, y'all be be blessed, man. Stay positive. Continue grinding, man. If you out here, man, work on your craft daily, man. Uh, don't take no for him, man. Continue to grind it.